If you are watching this video right now, you are a real one and I appreciate you 100%. I'm not expecting this video to get a ton of views or anything like that. It's not what this video is about. This isn't a banger. I mean, it might be a banger. Who knows? But this is mainly for my actives, for my real ones that, you know, support me 100%. And might have been wondering why I've been so inactive lately, so inconsistent. You know, during 2K20, I obviously uploaded a lot more. You know, at least once a week. I always made sure to get at least one video out a week. And this year, I just haven't been able to do that, you know, since 2K21. You know, it started out nice, like current gen, the prelude I dropped several build videos and some of those turn out to be my most popular videos my russell westbrook build video and it's funny because he was coming off one of the worst games of his career in the playoffs and like if you look at the comments half more like um yeah this probably wasn't the best time to make this video why'd you make a westbrook build video and uh i believe it has 27,000 views as i'm posting this video and probably gonna get a lot more it's my third most popular video how about that both my derrick rose videos did really good and you know in 2k21 current gen the first month i think i dropped the most videos in a month that i did i think i dropped like 14 15 videos that month and i i'm not gonna lie at the time i thought the views were down you know compared to my 2k20 videos but then i started uploading among us and next gen 2k and now i know the real meaning of views being down just everything being down so let's just get into the reasons you know um i'm not gonna lie to you guys i've been demotivated like it's just i had a plan right we all had a plan all of us small content creators even the big content creators we all had a plan we all talked about next gen like it was like gonna be revolutionary light changing remember 2k14 remember when the xbox one in the ps4's drop man like man i wish that's when i would have started uploading man uh probably be so much more different like knowing what i know now but obviously we we can't go back and I, i'm kind of glad that's not the case you know because i wouldn't have met some of the great people that i know you know the other small streamers and small content creators that i talk to that i believe will make it i know that they're still grinding through all of this but you know i just seen that the direction with 2k was going like current gen i could just see it like i played a 200 something games like the first week like i was gonna really grind the game out but it was same rep rewards, same everything. You know, uh, 2K dropped some patches that pretty much ruined current gen 2K21. I know a lot of you like it now because it might be better next gen. I, I may or may not make a video about that just for fun. But uh, current gen just got really unplayable for me. Maybe because the meta was you know, like screens and all that, pick and rolls. Everyone made pinkies, no one made outside centers. So, couldn't really ISO and play my game, you know? The meta, the gameplay might have been alright, but the meta was terrible for me. I was good at it. I mean, I can use screens. Using screens is way easier than ISO, but I just prefer to play ISO. It's just more fun for me. You know, my favorite players in real life, ISO. So, obviously, I want to play like them, you know what I mean? But, you know, I couldn't play how I wanted in current gen so you know i seen that among us was getting really popular most popular game arguably and uh i wanted to get on that because it looked fun and i started playing it and i had a lot of fun i i think among us i still think among us is a really good game i wish that those mods that toast and all of them are using like the sheriff jester and all that uh, proximity chat like I wish the Among Us game would actually add that to like you know all their games that way you don't have to mod 
that have access to those modes and that would keep the game popular but the game's starting to fall off and um yeah i tried to jump on the train and it just wasn't working like i was actually losing subscribers um for those that don't do youtube you can go in your analytics and click a video see the analytics of the video you can see like your watch time your views uh, ad, ad revenue and you can see subscribers gained or lost and there were some it was like i lost two subscribers off an among us video i lost three i mean yeah i understand that people subscribe to me for 2k and they don't want to see among us but still it doesn't change the fact that that kind of stuff hurts i'm not gonna lie to you guys like it was real demotivating posing something that i enjoyed but people just unsubscribe they just it just told me that some people don't like me for me they don't like lockmo jamin for lockmo jamin they like lockmo jamin for 2k content you know, there are guys, I want to be one of those guys that can post whatever I want. Because people just, you know, they're that loyal to me to where they can just watch me no matter what I do. I feel like on Twitch, uh, I feel like I have more loyals on Twitch and YouTube. I mean, I honestly don't have nearly as many followers on Twitch as I do subs on YouTube. But on Twitch, I feel like my viewership's always the same. Whether it's 2K, Among Us, I even I stream Fortnite. You, you people, I never uploaded a Fortnite video, so you guys don't even know that I play Fortnite. But yeah, my viewership's low key better on Fortnite, and it's funny because I'm actually really bad at Fortnite. I used to be decent, but that's besides the point. It, the point is, it's been real demotivating, and I thought maybe once I got next gen. Everything will be better, right? Because most of my subscribers are from 2K. But, um, yeah, next gen viewership is so low. I've looked at other big YouTubers. I shouldn't say, uh, like, I'm a big YouTuber. You know, I mean, I looked at big YouTuber channels and, like, man, their numbers are way down and it's mind boggling. That's how bad and dry the game is. Obviously, part of it has to do with not everyone having a next-gen console, but the game is just bad, and there's so many problems. Like, even if the gameplay was perfect, it'd still be trash because of the game freezing, the error codes, the Zion loading screen. 2K is just going down and down and down, and... You know, I don't even want to play 2K, let alone upload 2K. Like, 2K20, I didn't love it, but it was playable. Like, I could hop on, play whatever amount of games, get some gameplays for you guys, make some funny videos. Next gen, I don't feel like I can do that. So, not only is the game not enjoyable, but the numbers on... Like the results when I post the videos, it's just, you know, it's, it's really tough. And I haven't even been getting a lot of subs. I mean, I did hit 7K, thank you guys, but it took a, took a while. And for those that were sub to me from the beginning of 20, um, I was growing at a rapid pace. I went from 1.7K to, I think I hit 6K before 2K21 current gen. Maybe I hit it like, no, I think I hit it like a little after current gen came out, but yeah. Um, the next thing is I've been going through a lot personally. Not only have I been really busy with work, but personal life has been, obviously 2020 was a rough year, but 2021's off to a rough start. Um, not only has my job just been draining me. Like, not just physically draining me, but like mentally draining me. Like, this job is killing me, but I'm like stuck there, you know? Because I've been putting applications on our jobs, they're not going back, and you know, 
I'm I'm broke. Not broke, but like money's tight. I'm on a budget, you know. Um, this is for the loyal, so you know I'm gonna really open up to you guys like what I'm going through. Um, I'm in pretty bad credit card debt. I made some like a lot of it was because of school while I was going to school, and others was some irresponsible purchases like. At first, you know, it starts off like little payments, just you know, get your credit score up, you know, get good credit, because you know, once you're an adult, you're gonna realize having good credit is important. Uh, I'm not gonna get into all that, but you know, I'm sure you know, getting good credit is important. So like, once my balance went, like once I was able to spend more money on my credit card, I was like, holy shit! So I just started buying some, like you know, I did use my credit card to buy my gaming setup. Obviously, that's a good investment to make, but there are a lot of really stupid and irresponsible purchases I have made, and I am in really bad debt, and my job doesn't pay me well enough. Yeah, the money struggle has been really bad. Now, I know what you're thinking. Oh, well, YouTube money, which I'll get to that later. I mean, I'm, right now, it's just about the personal stuff. Um... Another thing that took up all my time was my grandfather. Um, for those that don't follow me on Twitter, my grandfather passed away earlier in the year from COVID. Um, so I had to be there for my mom and all that stuff. Um, there's some other things I don't think I should mention. But yeah, a lot of stuff's been going on personally. So that's why, that's, that's a really big reason, like, even if I, even if viewership wasn't down, like, even if my numbers are, like, 20, or even an improvement, I'd probably still be on this really bad upload schedule. It's mainly the personal stuff. Um, next up, I, I touched on a little bit earlier, but 2K is ass, man, but it's, it's unplayable. It's one thing if 2K was trash, but it was getting viewers, like, 19 and 20, trash games even 18 trash games but they pulled viewers next gen isn't doing it and current gen low-key isn't doing it people need to stop glorifying current gen because after a week y'all were saying that was the worst 2k ever like come on man and i'm not going back to current gen you know i'd rather play next gen so it's next gen iso's the meta like and by the way i Actually, I can't really compare win percents and stats on that game because, you know, I just got next gen. But still, 2K is trash. Not only is 2K trash, but the next gen consoles. I don't know about the PS5 because I don't have it. But the Xbox Series, it's literally a copy and paste of the Xbox One. Like, what a lazy effort on this new console that we all wanted so bad. Microsoft basically released a new console just because Sony was releasing a new console. Such a waste of money, and the graphics aren't even that great either. Like, I think 2K's next gen graphics are terrible. I still think 2K14 next gen has the best graphics, and 16, 15, they're like right there. You know, like, how's 2K's graphics getting worse and worse? Obviously, it's not about the graphics, it's about the gameplay, but it's so tough to make content on next gen because it's just fades. And posterizing dunks, you know? And hitting legend honestly ain't really worth it. Like, I noticed that, you know, like, people that are like legend are like one of the first people to hit elite, whatever, they're not getting rewarded with the viewership that you'll get reward in previous years. Obviously, Six God was the first legend. So, you know, first legend's always gonna get a lot of views. But, like, Six, compare Six God to Chalk's numbers when he hit first legend. I think Chalk's Legend video hit a million views. Like, that went crazy, you know? So, hitting Legends, I ain't worth it. And, you know, people just don't even want to play. He, if I want to play, no one wants to play that game. I have no one to play with. You know, if I have no one to play with, then I'm going to get the content for you guys. Another thing is for the <laughs> small YouTubers definitely know this. YouTube nerfed ad revenue and this was really bad for me because I'm a small content creator you know small content creators 
we're not pulling like the big YouTubers probably aren't affected by this. They're probably still making tons of money. And now like thousand view videos are making me three, four dollars. You know, before it was automatically at least ten. Like at worst. Like, come on. Obviously it's not all about the money. Like, I love posting videos. I love to entertain you guys. But at the same time, I'm spending money on thumbnails. I'm paying my boy Brazy. Shout out to Brazy, who is either letting this video play or he's actually watching this. Brazy, shout out to you, man. Best designer in the business. But I gotta pay him six dollars to make me a thumbnail. That being said, I'm probably making my own thumbnail for this video. Because this ain't gonna make me six dollars. You know? <laughs> But, I gotta pay them six dollars. You know, before, not a big deal. Because I always made that back. And even if I didn't, I was always close. Like, even if, like, let's say on a, a video I didn't get a lot of views, it would still get close. Right? And then the bangers, it would pay for that thumbnail and the thumbnail for that video too. And maybe even more than that. But now that's not even the case. Obviously, I'm not making as much money because, you know, I don't post as much. But, you know, uh, just one, one video, a thousand views, three dollars. Are you kidding me? That's ass. And Google, I don't know, I guess people are making too much money off the videos. I, I, I don't know what YouTube was thinking. Like, that's a source of income for me and other content creators, you know? Like I said, it's not all about the money, but... Remember, I got debt. I got bills to pay. So if, if I'm now paying my designer to make me thumbnails for videos and I can't make the money back, it's kind of deflating. You know what I mean? It is important. The money is important. You know? You guys gotta understand, like, I know a lot of people that watch me are kids and teenagers. So you don't understand what I'm going through as an adult. Like, I got bills to pay. So... Like I said, if I'm paying the designer and the money for the thumbnail, I'm not making it back on the video. I'm losing money. And I'm already in debt. That's bad. Now, obviously, I gotta learn to make my own thumbnails. Which, time has been anything but on my side lately. So, that's gonna lead me to my next point. Adulthood sucks, guys. You know, I gotta get my shit together, you know? Gotta get these bills, I gotta get that debt paid off. You know, like I said, a lot of you that watch me are teens, are kids. So, I just gotta give you all some advice right now. When you graduate high school, or if you decide to drop out of high school, you know, whatever you want to do. Just make sure you have a plan and you know what you're doing. Because... Out of high school, you know, like, you might think, you know, whatever, you're just going through school, whatever, enjoying, you know, whatever whatever you're doing in school. You're going to graduate before you know it. You're going to be out of school before you know it. And, you know, it, it just hit me, you know? So, when I got out, I had no idea what to do. Obviously, oh, go to college. Get your degree. You know? And find a job. But it's not that simple. You know, college ain't for everyone. College is not for me. You know? And neither is working retail. Which is why I want to make YouTube my job. Make Twitch my job. But obviously, it might not be the most realistic thing. You know, the most realistic goal. Obviously, I want to make it happen. I'm going to still try to make it happen. I'm not quitting. Notice how... I don't know what exactly the title is going to be yet, but notice how I'm done, question mark, I quit, question mark, nothing along those lines, nothing like that's in the title, because I'm not that kind of YouTuber, because I know I'm not going to pretend to quit, I'm not going to quit, I made that clear, my first video back, yeah, I already quit YouTube, so that's not an option this time, first video back, 2K20, I said, why am I back? All that matters is that I'm back, and this time I ain't going nowhere. And that's going to stay true. 
even if I'm not posting as much, I'm still gonna drop bangers for y'all. I'm not gonna quit. I'm just letting y'all know why I haven't been as active. And another thing is, I don't know what the hell to upload. I don't know what to do. 2K, Among Us, shit, Fortnite, Minecraft, Call of Duty. I have no idea what to do. Reactions. I don't know what to post. I don't know if 2K is the future. I don't know what my identity is on YouTube. And I don't know what direction I want to go. 2K, you know, it's easy. It's easy to get views. Or at least a decent amount of views. Among Us? I'm not gonna lie. That shit's hard. There's so much competition on Among Us. I got lucky a few times. But... It's... It's not easy. Uh, Fortnite? I know if I try Fortnite, that's gonna be really hard too. If I try Call of Duty. That'll probably be hard. Except for like, maybe class sub videos. But I'm not that good at Call of Duty. Like, I'm not gonna go 15 1. My best gameplays are probably like, when I go like 40 and 20 something, you know? And hey, man, it might be alright for you guys. I'm telling y'all know that 2K is like the only game that I'm decent at. You know? So, I have no idea what to post. Maybe you guys can help me out. I don't know. I really have no idea what to do on YouTube. That's honestly. Besides the personal stuff, the main thing is, I don't know what to do. Because I don't know if I want to stay in the 2K community. Because not only is 2K community, not only are, are we down bad right now, but like, the, what I want to do, like the kind of people that I want to be around, I'm not sure the 2K community has a lot of those people. A lot of toxicity, a lot of terrible people, you know? I try to be a good like. Y'all know, I'm chilling. I don't get toxic when people get toxic towards me. So, I don't know. I seriously do not know what to do, guys. But, the last thing I want to say is, I love you guys. You know, I appreciate each and every one of you that hit that subscribe button. Hit the follow button on Twitch. Hit the subscribe button on Twitch. Like, y'all go crazy for it. Those are still subbed to me. I don't, I haven't streamed at all this month yet, which I gotta pop a stream for y'all soon. Um, shout out to those that hit the like button, even if you never subscribe, just for watching a video. Definitely shout out if you're at this point in the video. Uh, yeah. I've been down bad, a lot of us in the 2k community have been down bad, but you know, it's not gonna stop me, it's not gonna stop y'all. Like I said, this video is to let you guys know what's up, and we ain't quitting, man. We're not quitting, you know. Um, we're gonna hit that 8k. Uh, we're gonna eventually hit 10k, and you know, so on and so forth, man. Just gotta roll with the punches, man. You know. Yeah, I love you guys. So. Yeah, I <laughs> really don't know what else to say, but that that's everything, you know? Uh, well, not everything. Got some, oh, excuse me, got some other things going on behind the scenes, but y'all gonna y'all gonna find out about that. But uh, yeah, I'm out. Peace.